Thanks to everyone who has subscribed. If you have not, please do. And thanks for coming out here. I really appreciate you. Good news. Edo Modern Refinery. 95% ready. First phase set to launch by the end of August. My people, this is a breaking news just reaching us at the minute. What can be more glorious? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time we're reaching you today. A very big thank you to every one of you out there who are supporting us, giving us a thumbs up, who are always there for us. We really appreciate you. May the Lord bless you. Thank you so much. Well, I come today to tell you of the wonderful thing that is about to take place in Edo State. Yes, good news. Very good news. Ah, uh, my people, we've been hearing Apple Live Media. We reported to you with regards to the refinery being done by your governor, Godwin Obaseki, a man of true good administration, I must say. Because the truth is, when you see a good thing, talk about it. We start at Apple Live Media condemn bad governance and we uh, discourage them. We talk about it so that they, they don't have that zeal to continue the more because we make it exposed to everyone. But guess what? When someone is doing something good as well, you encourage them. You speak about it. You don't only speak about the evil or the bad, but you talk about the good one. Well, my people, in those states, better days ahead. 95% of the refinery ready and your governor is ready, ready to commission and to launch out the first phase. What does this mean? Job employment. Yes, is industrializing the, 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 the state of a uh, those state. People, sons and daughters, it is your time, you know, to have when there is job security, when people are able to take care of their bills. This is, you know, this is what we call true development. Any government who is looking forward to alleviating the suffering of his people, putting the people first, making sure that roads are done and um, opportunity for employment are in place, that is the government to follow. So at those states, you are in, in you are in for a good season. Is night we reported it was 75 percent as we speak 95 percent first phase about to be commissioned and so that uh, work can begin what wonderful day to celebrate let's carry on and get all the details the refinery cited in logbo local government area of edo state is now comp is near completion and will start production in about three weeks from now i told you it's good news in an on-site interview with the project director, Mr. Shegun, he said, all the needed equipment are ready. And as you can see, we are almost done with the construction aspect. The only thing left is the installation of hydrocarbon. A dough modern refinery will commence operation. I told you it's good news. He added, there are seven large tanks already built to store the four different products, diesel, naphtene, fuel, oil, and gas. Also, the first phase will produce about a thousand barrels per day. Hmm. Edo State is becoming industrialized, my people. Hmm. Take brain or get sense. Hmm. Mr. Shegun disclosed that apart from the technical aspects, who only make up about 20% of the entire staff. The larger percentage is made up of Edo people, including people from the host community. They will be employed. And they are now work in batches due to COVID-19. When further asked about their relationship with the host community, he said, we have a good relationship with them. They have never been hostile. We are also repairing the faulty portion of the Bene Wari Road in the local area as a CSRO commitment to them. The safety officer, who is also from the host community, very good, using the people of the community, ensure that we are fully kitted with appropriate PPEs, helmets, and safety boots before we continued with the faulty road and production management. Temi Tani took us through the production process. The crude tank atmosphere distillator hits 
transferrer, cooling system, storage, and everything we needed to see and know. This is a good thing the governor is doing for the people of Edo State. So my dear, there you go. There you have it. The refinery is 95. When we reported to you, it was 75. Today, as we speak, it is what? 95. What more can you want? What more can you ask for? This is of a vision of a man. This is the vision of a man who sat down and came into, you know, came into politics and said, what can I do to better the life of my people? How can I be of help and of service? What will I be remembered for if I have finished my work and I've finished and I've left as a governor after serving all the terms I, am, I have the opportunity to be able to serve? And he thought about it. He said, giving what? Uh, good, ad, giving what? Good, good um, administration. Living legacy that will, life, that will last a lifetime was what Governor Gordon Obaseki began to put in place. As we speak to you right now, the Edo refinery is 95% completed. 95%. What does that mean? Work is commencing in NAM. I mean, production will be commencing very soon. By the way, the governor is commissioning this project in August here, a few days to go. A few days to go. By the end of August, this project will be commissioned and you can smile. And guess what? They are employing people from the host community. Very good. Bringing them into, you know, bringing them into jobs. And it's the sons and daughters of a do state that will be employed. It is the sons and daughters. Everyone who have a relation, who lives around the area, are the ones that will be employed. Once they are, uh, you know, the whole uh, operation stage starts, it's up to you to go there and see where you come in, what you can do to help out with this work. And guess what? That is true transformation. That is true industrialization. And before you know it, Edo State become a hall of, you know, development and true democracy. A place where people are happy. Edo State, make a right decision. Make a right choice. This same governor we are talking about is the person seeking a return into office. And some persons are saying, no, we don't want you. Go. But come to think of it. What do you want at those states? Do you want such transformation to continue? Because this is only one. And what it means is that there is more opportunity for further growth and development if you give good, 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 good governance opportunity a chance. It means that Edo State can truly become a model in the recent times of what is going on in Nigeria. How many governments, even at the federal level, has thought it deem, deem it fit to put a deem it fit to put uh, to put you know to put the people first? How many governments have deemed it fit to make sure that the people of Edo State enjoy true democracy? How many governments has deemed it fit? to make sure that Nigerians enjoy what we call, you know, uh, there is job em employment and opportunity. What do you think? God bless you. Bye for now.